Now, on Wednesday night, former House Speaker John Boehner uh, essentially called GOP candidate Ted Cruz Lucifer in the flesh. Satan. Now, when asked for his opinion on the senator from Texas, Boehner said, quote, I have Democrat friends and Republican friends. I get along with almost everyone. For example, uh, tobacco companies. I have to keep bringing that up. He actually handed out tobacco checks on the floor. That's amazing. Anyway, he continues. I've never worked with a more miserable son of a bitch in my life. <laughs> hey, look, to be honest, I know those kinds of people, right? See, I know the ones that you can get along with when you've had a few drinks. I could, I could easily see myself having drinks with Lindsey Graham and actually having a good time. Playing a little bit of pool, whatever, right? Seems like a decent guy, even though he's terrible, terrible, terrible person on policy. And he's an absolute neocon warhawk. But you could have a few drinks, have a fun time, right? But then there's smug assholes like Ted Cruz. The guy you want to punch in the face, okay? No matter how sober or drunk you are, you could be, you could have smoked a bunch of weed and be the most relaxed date and see Ted Cruz and be like, I want to punch that motherfucker in the face. That's the guy. <laughs> But anyway, when asked by the friendly atheist about Ted Cruz, the Satanic Temple uh, had this to say through their spokesman, Lucian Greaves. Quote, Cruz's failures of reason, compassion, decency, and humanity are products of his Christian pandering, if not actual Christian faith. It grows tedious when pedophile priests and loathsome politicians are conveniently dismissed as satanic, even as they spew biblical verse and prostrate themselves before the cross. Recruiting the Christian faithful, Satanists will have nothing to do with any of them. Now, also, in a statement to Huffington Post, Grease also said this about Boehner's statement, quote, It is past time we stop blaming the activities of the upholders of the Christian faith on a Satanic philosophy. Boehner is trying to convey that if it is bad and he disagrees with it, it is of Satan and Lucifer. And if it is of good, it is of Christ. That is what's problematic with the Christian ideology. He continues, I don't think it's Boehner is I don't think Boehner is necessarily saying that he actually thinks Cruz is a Satanist because I just don't think he's thinking that hard about the issues. These are simple minded people. Our situation in US politics is much worse than you can imagine. Now all of that is actually reading into it probably much more than I would like to. I think he just generally hates Cruz. <laughs> And wasn't thinking about this, but then again, Greece was right, is that it's pretty simple-minded, right? These are simple-minded people making simple-minded statements about other simple-minded people who just happen to be punchable dicks. Anyway, Greece also directs uh, Ted Cruz, uh, he directly addresses Ted Cruz, quote, I think he is a real disaster. I think he's possibly one of the worst I think we've been in a race to the bottom for a long time now. And you can't and you keep thinking it can't get worse and people would wise up after a clown like Sarah Palin or George W. Bush. But then you see people lining up around Ted Cruz. And here's where Greaves is right. Ted Cruz is an absolute disaster and would be a complete disaster for the country. And I agree that he's one of the he is the worst candidate. He is a fundamentalist who used Christianity to spread hatred, division, and bigotry all for his own political gain. Plus, the guy believes that he's anointed to be the king of America. The guy's nuts. But here's the thing, right? Playing on people's core identity as Christians, as he does, to get elected to office based on the hatred of the other, when Jesus supposedly hung around with the other, is hypocritical. Now, I've got two thoughts on this, on this whole thing. Either Ted Cruz knows that he's playing these people like that, or even worse, he buys his own brand of pseudo-Christian fundamentalist bullshit. Either way, Ted Cruz is still far more dangerous than Donald Trump. And people know it. 